What the? Hey! Dang wind! Come back here! Slippery little devil! Hold still! Hey! Oh man! Well, shoot. Oh, what a cute little thing. I'd like to, but this dress just doesn't have the pockets for it. I'm gonna ditch this thing once and for all. Okay, dog. You're coming with me. <laughs> He's got a bag of holding, I guess. It's empty. It says, Dear Booty Island Waste Disposal Service. Shh. Please don't bang garbage cans. Governor sleeping upstairs. Hey! Kitchen staff only! Sorry. What is all the racket? Don't mess with the governor's cans! And time to hey, run away from the murderer. Here. I'm not done yet! Who do you think you are? Time to rob the place. Anything else? Oh, there you are! Anyway, like I was saying, you better just get out of here! No good punk! Huh. Well, he seemed nice. Where do you want to go? Oh. Yeah, now we're going to talk to this fisherman guy for absolutely no reason. Uh, yeah. Caught anything yet? Are you kidding? I reached my limit hours ago. Yeah. I'm Guybrush Threepwood, a mighty fisherman. Oh, you are, are you? I'm the best fisherman in these isles. Oh, I beg to differ with you. I'm the best fisherman in these isles. You? Why, you couldn't catch fish at a restaurant. The pike I catch make Pike's Peak look like an anthill. That's why I'm known as the Blowfish. You mean the blow hard. Listen, bait for brains. I'm the best around, and that is that. Not if your reel is as rusty as your imagination. Perhaps you'd like to make a small wager, eh, Mr. Fisherman? Sure, I'll take your bet. Let me tell you what I had in mind first. 
If you can catch a bigger fish than I can, I'll give you my prize-winning fishing pole. What's the catch? If I catch a bigger fish than you, you have to eat it. Raw. Ooh, you mean on rice with a little wasabi and soy sauce? No. Plain cold and with the head still on it. What do you say? All right, it's a bet. Great. I am really looking forward to making you eat my catch. What with all the sewage from Governor Fat's mansion, the fish are usually pretty gross. I never eat mine. Just sell them to restaurants. Best get fishing, buddy. <laughs> well, time to win this bet completely legitimately. Um, think I'll drop a line right here. Plunk. Wow, I've got a nibble already. Holy cow, he's a monster! I've got him! <laughs> what a battle! Wow! This is the biggest... The, uh, well, it, it's almost as big as the Leviathan I just hauled in. Really? Where is this Leviathan? Uh, uh, I think you're lying. Yeah, you're right. It was just a fish story. Uh -huh. I guess you win. Here, take the pole. Remember, kids, always cheat. Uh, let's see. Wanted, Guybrush Threepwood, for the murder of G.P. LeChuck. Also for the use of witchcraft on the person of Largo Legrand, the thievery of clothing and medically prescribed hair supplements for such witchcraft, grave robbing, trespassing, larceny without a permit, disturbing the peace, illegal gambling on a sporting event, exceeding allowable FDA limit for rodent parts in Vichyssois, vandalizing a historical miniature, reckless use of gardening tools, unauthorized exiting from a penal institution, possession of library books not specifically checked out to oneself, and releasing a dangerous reptile in a populated area. Also wanted for questioning regarding the disappearance of prescription eyewear. I love that it it has everything, including I gave the wrong name for my library card and it added it to the list. Now let's add something else to the list. Excuse me, aren't you Guybrush Threepwood? No, my name is Kate Capsize. You must have me confused with someone else. Kate, eh? That's an unusual name. Perhaps you have some identification. My ID is on my ship. Wait here while I go and get it. Nice try, Guybrush. I don't know how you got out of the jail, but I'm taking you back in. Where'd you want to go? Oh, time to leave her in there forever. Um, let's see, what else do we need to do? Uh, la 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 la. Oh, fine. Oops. Idiots. Who is this Peepwind character anyway? Guybrush Threepwood. Arrested for infractions too numerous to list. Claims she was framed. Hey, there's some near grog in here. Idiots. Fools. Fools. Who is this Peepwind character anyway? Who is this Peepwind character anyway? Hey! Uh-oh. I can explain, I- Thanks for letting me out of there. You'll have to excuse me if I don't stick around. I've got to find out who framed me. It's Captain Kate. <laughs> Where'd you want to go? All right, um... All right, there's... As funny as that is, it takes a while. 
Steam and weenies, 20 feet. Hmm, this door appears to be locked. Now, from the book that we read earlier, one of the people that has the map uh, ran that place. Oh, sorry. We need something from here. Oh, we need several things from here. You're supposed to be cooking. I took my break. It's the law. Nice try, but not good enough. You're fired. Excuse me. Yeah, boy? Grog, please. I'll need to see some ID for that. Will you accept a temporary library card? Let me see it. Freelance? Is that anything like a sanitary engineer? No, not quite. Well, all right. Can I get you that drink now? Yeah, I could really use it. Name your poison. What do you got? Well, we have some specialty drinks here at the Bloody Lip, like... Yellowbeard's baby, bloody stump, and blue whale. Mix me up a blue whale. Sorry, blender's not big enough. <laughs> oh, but seriously, that'll be one piece of eight. Okay. There she blows. And here's a complimentary crazy straw. We give them to all new customers of the bloody lip. I wonder why they call it the bloody lip. When it's a, a broken glass. Bartender, give me a drink. Name your poison. Give me a bloody stump. I can't. Chainsaw's out of gas. Ha 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 ha. Hilarious. Yeah, I cracked myself up. That'll be one piece of eight. Okay. Here you go. Nice place you have here. Well, see ya. He's cute. I don't want to disturb him. I don't want to hurt him. Excuse me. Yeah, boy? Nice place you have here. Well, see ya. It's a metronome. No thanks. Too many bad memories of piano lessons. I don't want to get the monkey mad. He's pretty good at that. Really good at the metronome. Oh, hey, a banana. Hey, what'd you do to my piano player? Hypnotize him. He's cute. Hey, he's mine now. Go ahead and take my entertainment. Thanks for nothing, buddy. Okay. You can keep the banana. Alright, we've had some theft. Uh, now for, for some larceny. Doctor! 
Who could have possibly have done something like that? It says, out on house call. Please come again. Sweet, free nails. Sweet, free hammer. I can't. He's lacquered it onto the wall. Ah, well. I was going to say hi to her. I wouldn't mind a house with a door like this. Golden Tongue, the five-day treatment plan that helps you talk to women. No thanks, I don't need it. Ash to Life, the uncremating cream. Back again, Mr. Threepwood? About that voodoo doll? Yes, it worked pretty well, didn't it? I still have the touch. Uh, about that jar I was looking at? That's one of my most powerful potions. Brings the dead back to life. I'll take it. There are some complications. It only works on ashes, and the resurrection is only temporary. Plus, you need to bring me a sample of the subject's ashes before I can mix you up a batch. Boy, voodoo's complicated. Rules are rules. Well, that's enough voodoo for me. Bye. So be it. All right, just a little bit of foreshadowing for a uh, puzzle coming up. Where do you want to go? Three hour tours. Are you the same Kate who bought all the near grog at the Bloody Lip? Yeah, and you can't have any of it, so don't ask. I'm searching for the treasure of Big Whoop. Yeah? When I was the first maid on the Limping Limpet, we went in search of Big Whoop. We'd heard it was buried under a place called Blinky Island. Never found the island or the treasure. The captain eventually died of boredom while we were crossing the Sea of Beige Flotsam. I hope your luck is better. I'm interested in chartering a ship. Great. As I mentioned, my fee is 6,000 pieces of eight. I'll come back later. Okay, I'll be here. See the world. See the world. I have to remember how I get Well, that. well, well. I knew you'd come back. My customers always do. Eventually. Could you show me that coffin again? Okie dokie. Now this isn't just your average 60 gallon coffin. This has the full 75 gallons you need to avoid unsightly bone readjustments. Could you get in and show me how big it is again? Yes, sirree. I could spend a lot of time in a coffin like this. Sure, sure. Try out the lid operation. It's just as roomy clothes. Best part of the game. I hear you knocking up there. That's solid oak you're hearing. Yes, it sure is nice in here. Hey, I think the lid's stuck. Um... Excuse me, friend. Could you see if the clasp is closed on this thing? I seem to be stuck. Hello? Is anybody out there? Uh, be there in a minute. Yoo-hoo! Help! I can't get out of here! 
Okay, a joke's a joke. Now get me out of here. Open this coffin right now. Anybody? I really am claustrophobic. Someone's going to pay for this. I'd bust out of here, but the dang thing's built too well. Well, if I had to be stuck in a coffin, at least it's the deluxe model. Hmm, really is pretty roomy in here. Maybe I'll take a nap. Are you still out there? Hello? See Poor the Stan. Sightseeing. Thank you all for watching. You're welcome to come see me record these episodes live at twitch.tv slash superbunnybun. You can also come say hi on Twitter at superbunnybun. But most importantly, I'd really appreciate it if you could like yourself, comment about how awesome you are, and subscribe to Happy Thoughts. And until next time, stay spicy and huggable. Bye!